eight to show the runners you're gonna hold them on. Jake Bowers drills it to center field. Going back, Bernard, to the warning track, to the wall, and it's out of here! Jake Bowers, first home run of the season. The Rail Riders on the board, one nothing. Bottom half of the second inning here at PNC Field. The 0-1 to Bowers. Drills out towards right center field. Got some carry, heading to the warning track. Wall off the base of the wall. Shaparo on his way. Shelly Duncan's gonna wave him home. Shaparo, here comes the throw to the plate. Bounces in offline. Shaparo avoids home. Brantley can't catch the ball. It's skipped back in front of home plate. You know, there isn't this kind of for virus. This pitch is drilled by Jake Bowers out to deep right center field. Guthrie loses it in the lights and doesn't matter. It's way out of here, out to right center. Guthrie had thrown up his hands. He didn't know where it was. That's because it was over the wall in right center as Jake Bowers has tied this game at two here in the fourth. It's Scranton Wilkesbury two and Lehigh Valley two. The one one, Stewart elevates it. Left center field, Peraza backing up. Bowers is on the move, will make a sliding grab. Hangs on to it as he goes to the grass. Shaparo and the coaching staff. Bowers. Skies one out towards right center field. Davis and Lee going back. Still on the way back. It skips off the wall. Jake Bowers is going to get a triple. <laughs> Shelly Duncan telling him to stand up, easing in. Bowers, line drive out to right field. This is going. It is gone. Three run blast for Jake Bowers. Scranton Wilkesbury jumps on the board for the second straight game. Three runs in the opening inning thanks to a home run. It's Jake Bowers with the blue moonshot, his fourth of the season. Well, I guess that settles it. Bowers wins the battle. Anyways, Dunham on third, Shaparo on second. In the bottom of the third, Rail Riders trying to make some moves. Two in scoring position, just one out. Jake Bowers. Brings this high in the sky, deep to right field. Tadrola back at the warning track, jumps up. It's gone. Another three-run shot from Jake Bowers in back-to-back -back at bats, and he puts Scranton Wilkesbury on top, 6-3. Well, we know who won the battle against Dylan Bundy for the second time today. 1-0 to Bowers, crushes this out to right field. Tadrola at the warning track, it is gone. Jake Bowers, a three home run day. He puts the Rail Riders back on top for the third time this contest. It's 9 7, Scran Wilkesbury. That is the fourth eight RBI game in franchise history. Has the biggest smile on his face as he shakes Shelly Duncan's hand, rounding third, comes home. Bowers, three home runs. There's Jake Bowers 0 for 2 with a walk. This one a fly ball down the left field line, slicing towards the corner. And that's a fair ball. Garlic just, I think he thought that was foul. Jog towards the ball into score. One, two. It's towards the left center gap, and this is going to split the defense. And it'll roll all the way to the wall. Shaparo on his way to third. He is going to come in to score. And making the turn is Bowers looking for third. He got stuck in no man's land and heads back to second. Another double. What the Saints have done is gone to the bullpen as Winder deals a pitch to McKin or to Bowers rather that is crushed to right field. And this one is gone. A towering shot to right field, and Jake Bowers hits his seventh home run of the season. And that makes it three to one. So Winder who gave up a home run in his First appearance with the Saints in rehab. 3-2. High fly ball, straight away center field. Lamar going back. He's on the warning track. He's at the wall. He leaps and it's gone. And Bowers joins the two home run club for the day. A solo shot to center field. That was a good at bat. He fouled a few pitches off and finally got McGill. On the solo home run, or the two run home run rather, to the straight away center. And it is 8-3. He got a fastball that might have been above the strike zone. He went after a high pitch here. Hear his thoughts. Bowers with a deep drive to right field. The second home run of the inning for Scranton. So Chaparro hitting home run number eight two batters ago. And now Bowers retakes the lead with home run number nine. And it's an eight nothing Rail Rider lead.
Yeah, baseball doesn't usually work this way. You come into a series and the unexpected always happens in this game. But, well, the two things that stu stood out. Lockridge goes. Bowers unloads out towards deep right center field. Going back, Rafael, it's gone. Bowers smashes this one in dead center. And the Rail Riders tie things up. We are back in action once again. What a rehab start for Jake Bowers. Pitching staff and working pitching staff. 3-2 Bowers sliced out the opposite way. This given a ride. Hits one hop to the wall. And Jake Bowers into second. Will ease in with a stand-up double. And the Rail Riders have the go-ahead run in scoring position with one away. You see of Casey Dental. Bowers line drive to center field. Abreu gives chase. This bounce one hop to the wall. Jake's on his way to second. The throw into second, not in time. Stand-up double for Jake Bowers. Two for two tonight. And Bowers, high drive, deep right field. Going up, Balka, and this is into the berm. Jake Bowers with a moonshot to right field. 11th of the season here for the Rail Riders, 18th. The most in his career in a year. And it's now 5-2. Worcester still on top, but the Rail Riders inching back.